This video describes a new prototype of a non-invasive brain actuated wheelchair adapted to improve mobility for people with devastating neuromuscular disorders. The device is composed of a brain computer interface that measures the human electroencephalogram and by an intelligent wheelchair equipped with a laser sensor. When in operation, the user faces a screen displaying a real-time virtual reconstruction of the scenario and concentrates on the location to reach. A visual simulation process elicits the neurological phenomenon and the EEG signal processing detects the target location. This location is transferred to the autonomous navigation system that drives the wheelchair to the desired location while avoiding collisions with the obstacles in the environment detected by the laser scanner. A great advantage is that once the order is given, the user can relax as navigation is automated, avoiding exhausting mental processes. In order to command the wheelchair, the user must select destinations or motion primitives by concentrating on the possibilities displayed on the computer screen. The neurophysiological protocol is based on the P300 visually evoked potential. This potential manifests itself as a positive deflection in the EEG at a latency of roughly 300 milliseconds after the desired target stimulus is presented within a random sequence of non-target stimuli. To elicit this potential, an option is stimulated by displaying a circle on the selection. One stimulation process is the stimulation of all options in random order. The EEG is recorded during this process and transferred to a supervised learning module that is trained to recognize the P300 evoked potential and thus to infer the option that the user is attending to. The option selected is transferred to the navigation system of the intelligent wheelchair using a communication system which performs the integration between the brain computer system and the wheelchair. The task of the autonomous navigation system is to drive the vehicle to a given destination while also avoiding obstacles, both static and dynamic, detected by the laser sensor. The navigation system has modeling and planning capabilities which allow the system to provide mobility skills even in an unknown environment or where the environment varies with time. For example, when working around moving people or when there are sudden changes in the location of furniture. Another advantage is that this navigation technology is able to deal with complex and dense scenarios. One typical situation that exploits this technology usually appears when crossing a doorway, where the system needs to pass through a narrow space while maintaining a security distance.